Just an update on my terror tank involving my tiger barbs, piranha, and erratus. Uh, I was asked to do another worm feeding video, which I'm going to do here in a minute, now that the piranhas are a little bit older and uh, the tiger barbs a little bit older. Uh, something that did happen, which hasn't happened in the past, but it did happen this time. Uh, those of you who know, I put five piranhas in here, mixed them with my tiger barbs. Everything was going good. And I had two little piranhas that just were not putting the weight on. The others grew pretty fast. And two of them just were not putting the weight on. And we found that the tiger barbs just disintegrated them. So I have three piranha instead of five. It just kind of goes to show you what these little guys can do, especially when they're in this high quantity of numbers. So I'm working with three piranha instead of five. Whether that's gonna change in the future, I don't know. But for now, that's what I got. And we're gonna feed these little guys here. One of the worms that I have hooked up already. And we're gonna just take a look and see what they can do. So I'm gonna put this down for a minute. These tiger barbs have gotten really big. The erratus have gotten more aggressive. The piranhas have come out and have been eating like this, these guys right here. They come up and take what they want. I'm really upset that I lost two of them and it wasn't due to the piranhas eating each other, it was due to the, the aggression of the tiger barbs and the erratus, they just destroyed them and they ate them, otherwise I'd show you what they can do. But as you can see, they have no problems tearing this worm to pieces. It, I mean, it really just takes maybe a minute, two minutes, and they'll have this thing in pieces. They get goldfish every now and then. I will do a goldfish video. The, gold, the goldfish do not last long, but I'm going to wait just a little bit longer to do a goldfish video. These guys love them some worms. Those piranhas get up there and they just start taking the little pieces as well. But they don't hold on to it. Once the piranha gets a hold of a piece, the tiger barbs are pretty quick to get them out of their mouth. I do have one large piranha that just went crazy as far as growth. I'm trying to find out where he's at. I thought he was down there somewhere. Yeah, it was a shame that the little piranhas died, but I'll see what else I could do with that. You see, this guy's just destroyed. The piranha gets up in there. Now, any of you know what a jewel is, a jewel cichlid, they are pretty mean themselves, and I've had jewels in the past, and I thought about doing a jewel aquarium. So that might be a, a future project. But for now, we'll stick with these guys. And that looks like the end of the worm almost. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. And comment below if you have any ideas. Thanks.